Hey, Calvary family, after much prayer and consideration, we have decided as a leadership team, in accordance with the CDC's recommendations, to move all of our services to an online live stream format for the sake of everyone's health and safety. This begins immediately with our first service tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Join with us for all of our online services, Sundays at 10 a.m., Wednesdays at 7 p.m. We invite you to call your friends and your family to log on and watch as well. This schedule will continue for at least two weeks, at which time we will reevaluate and update you on our future schedule. It is everyone's desire to resume regular worship services at Calvary as soon as possible. You can find our live stream in three locations. Our website is caop.church live. Our YouTube page is at Calvary Assembly of God. And our Facebook page is at Calvary Orange Park. We want to communicate to you the importance of community in a time like this. We hope that you'll choose to stay connected despite any physical distance. Each of you plays such a vital role in our church family and in the kingdom of God. And we want to facilitate an online environment that is uplifting to you and that glorifies God. I want to encourage everyone to remain faithful in every way that we can by tuning into the live stream for worship and ministry, staying connected to your Calvary family by calling each other, texting, or just posting an encouraging word on social media. We all need that at a time like this. Some have asked if they should stop by and drop their tithes and offerings at the church office, and you're certainly welcome to do that. Our office remains open weekly. The best time is to stop by between Tuesday and Thursday at 9.30 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. You can also give online at caop.church slash give or text to 904-447-2898. Pastoral care is a priority for us at Calvary. Our pastoral staff will be available to be reached via phone, email, or by appointment during church office hours. I know in these uncertain times that many questions arise and maybe even some anxiety or stress. God's word is so powerful to speak to every situation that arises in our lives. The Apostle Paul wrote in Philippians chapter four, don't worry about anything, instead pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank him for all that he has done. Then you will experience God's peace, which exceeds anything that we can understand. His peace will guard your hearts and minds as you live for Christ Jesus. I believe in this moment, we as Christ followers and as the church will arise in God's strength and power to offer hope and peace to the world around us and to each other. I love you and God bless you.